it's dead. Here in a blower motor change. Tyler here working with me today. We just got him doing an AC install. Yeah, he's got a lot of cool matchbox cars. He's a car guy if you haven't told him, noticed. So this motor, as you heard, was grunting. Um, really loud. Uh, a customer came back from Florida and he, um, yeah, it was just seized up, and uh, his daughter came in to turn the furnace on before they got home, and it was just just loud. So this is a oh, what is this? It's a Reem Rude Rud Shearer ninety plus overachiever, underachiever. Um, this is a UGRA 09EZAGJS. I got the screw holes on the side, I hope. Yep, uh, right there, I believe, for the. Yeah, there's a couple. Okay. Yeah, and this is a Sentry. Um, Sentry blower motor. It uh, even comes with a, a start capacitor. Is that new? Huh? That's new. Yeah, brand new. Okay, so you gotta take these off. Right. And kind of line that up where you need it to be. All right. That's how I do. Kind of like this, and then take them off, put them on. I would use this one here. Right. Switch that around a quarter. Are you a, a contractor and trying to get your phones to ring? Struggling with that? Try Footbridge Media. Uh, Two forty nine a month. They'll get you a website, and then the, if you're not on Google, you need to be on Google so your customers can find you. Uh, Two forty nine a month. They will get you a website created and search engine optimization. It's very important so people can find you, call you, and your phones will start ringing again. Um, Two forty nine a month. The link is in the description below. Check them out. Put that one down there as you're taking them off so you know where they're at. So I'll line it up to find the holes. I would probably. Who's that? Can't see. I'd probably do. Wasn't that how that one was? Actually, this, this motor is a little bit longer. So I would probably try it right there. Don't give your onions. Okay, put the other one in. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take the other bracket off, put that one on. So Tyler's 19 years old. He's been working with, with me since uh, last September. He's worked with me off and on uh, throughout the years. Nothing crazy, though, but he's helped me out uh, doing some duct work and stuff. How do you like it so far, Tyler? Good. Good. Is it your cup of tea now? A little bit. Good. And a few months ago, he says, I don't know if this is my cup of tea, Dad. And I said, what is, working at McDonald's? And he was, I think he was just getting intimidated by all the work thrown at him. And, and uh, yeah, it takes takes a little while to 
learn everything. I don't even know everything. There's still stuff out there I'm learning. And if you're not if you're not learning, you, you're dead. You know, I try to I try to learn as much as I can, and I'm not a super tech. I'm not a master tech. I'm just learn by by trial and errors. And I, you know, I've been doing this since 1992, but um, I'm still learning. You know, there's a lot of a lot of you guys out there that are, I guess, what you call super techs, and you went to some schooling and. Yeah, you guys know way more than I do. There's nothing wrong with that, you know. But there's some things out there that I know that you don't know either. So we are, we're all here to learn from each other. Ain't that right, Tyler? Yep. Nice and tight. Yep. Okay, go ahead and set her in. All right. In there. Get this old, old guy out of here. It weighs as much as a boat anchor. I probably spin it around so the wiring harness is over here. Okay. There you go. I gotta go get her down in there. Okay. Okay, those screws I believe are all up here. Tyler. Alright, I think you dropped one down here, but I'm not sure. Mm. I mean, you dropped one down there? I don't think I dropped one. Oh, they're all right here, Tyler. Yeah, right here. Oh. Where'd that one come from? Uh -huh. That's Is that off from one of the sides? Is everything off? So, yeah, I got them. Okay. And this, uh... This customer of mine, he was my electrician for a long time, and he's retired now, so he's out doing retiree stuff, I guess. Okay, I'll flip her up, and then we got to scoot the squirrel cage. Okay, uh, this way. Yep, bring it up towards you. Well, this is an AMRAD. I was looking at those last night, and those are not cheap. It's an AMRAD. It was made in USA. Made in USA. Master Fit, Master Fit Pro. So how's this going to work? Okay, so... So you can do seven and a half, five, or two and a half. So, and that's your common. So we got to do a jumper. So that's so what's seven and a half? Seven point five times two. Seven point five times two. Uh huh. And that uh, what is it? Fifteen. Yeah, that's exactly what we need, isn't it? Yeah. So what we got to do is. Jumper, 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 and then we put one lead on there and then the common. Bit. 
And this one will go in there. And that's all wired up there, so. Oh, we got a slide on this. Back in. together again okay so I'm gonna take off you figure it out right Neutralis, aka neutral. Uh, all right, so I gotta fix this one tail because somebody didn't have it put in all the way. through the river and through the woods. So usually if you jumper R and G down here, the AC will come on. Um, so that's why I pulled this off, so that way when I do it, even though it's warm outside, I'm not trying to get the AC to come on. I just want to see if... Okay, so you see this. I'm trying to see... That's how you test to see if the blower, you can test the blower to come on by jumper in it, R and G, but take off your W or Y terminals, otherwise your AC is going to kick on, especially in the winter time. You don't want your AC to be coming on in the winter time. Well, would you look at that? That's pretty snifty. I like that kit. I'm going to have to put one of those kits on my truck. And plus, it comes with an AMRAD uh, capacitor. These things are made in USA. Oh, I'm gonna be able to do. Actually, I can probably do it this way. Is that gonna fit? Oh, I can maybe make it fit. tie around all this god forgiven mass and it's like a big mess of spaghetti okay there Surface igniter going on. 
know, that's that's nice. got any value out of this content give me a smash that thumbs up button give me a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed yet consider subscribing it's free it doesn't cost nothing it helps the channel grow and if you're the one who's smashing that thumbs down buttons do that twice that'd be great see you in the next one